as you can tell from the title of this video, we are going to look at a brand new luxury community that's located on the island right in between Sebastian and Vero. So this community is Sea Glass and it's located on Wabasso Beach Boulevard about a quarter mile away from the Disney Resort and Wabasso Beach. So it's going to start out at 1.2 million and go all the way to 1.8. So it's a 72 single family and villa community, seven of which have already sold. So you know this is going to go fast. There are currently no models available to go look at, but I'll throw some up on the screen just so you know the quality of build of GHO. Okay, so now that we're back inside, let's take a look at the site plan and then we'll go over some of the models. So as you can see, um, you enter through Wabasso Beach Road or County Road 510 and you have Wabasso Beach right here as well as this unaffiliated resort area. That's the Disney resort that I was talking about earlier. So you come on in and you'll notice that you'll have the villas all located on the left-hand side when you're driving into the community, as well as you have the model home. Um, you actually have three model homes all located right here. So um, the rest are gonna be single family along this uh, section right here. And you'll have um, a couple more single family homes until you get into the villas on this uh, on this section. So, so let's go over some of the floor plans. Um, I won't bore you clicking through every single one. We'll go over the lower model and then the higher model and we'll touch on uh, some of the HOA fees as well. So this is a three bedroom, three bath, two car garage, 2200 square feet in living space. And this is the sea breeze model. So this is um, what you're going to get with the GHO quality homes. It has that Florida luxury feel. You have trees hanging over and you'll notice in the video that um, they're really particular about the, the trees. They'd like the established trees. So I won't click through um, too many of these just because I don't wanna bore you guys and I'll leave a link to the website down below. Um, and if you have questions, just feel free to reach out. I have a connection with um, GHO. So Let's go down into the higher price point. We'll give you the mid range first. So you have the Sapphire model. This is going to be a three bedroom, one den, three bath with a two car garage, 2,600 in square living space. And this is 1.6 million. So um, this is what you're going to get for that kind of middle price point. Another thing to keep in mind, if you're looking for a second home in Florida, and this community is slightly out of your price range, you might want to check out Devosta, which I made another video about. It's a gated community directly located in between Sebastian and Vero on the other side of the bridge. So it starts out at around $500,000. Obviously it goes up, but it's a great alternative and you're still super close to the beach, super close to Disney Resort, um, pretty much this whole area smack dab in the middle. But if you're finding this information to be useful, give a like and comment if you have any questions. Let's go with the Indigo at 1.8. So this is getting into the higher price point. And you can see this again is going to be a three bedroom, one den, three bath, three car garage with 2,600 square feet in living space. So um, this is going to be the floor plan that you're gonna get with the Indigo. So you have a solid understanding. So going into the Sapphire, we have a three bedroom, one den, three bath, two car garage with 2,600 square feet in living space. And this is the floor plan that you're going to get um, with the Sapphire model. Um, again, I won't. I don't want to bore you guys too much just clicking through floor plans. That's something you could do on your own. But um, you have the HOA fees that are going to be $628 per month. And then you do have gated beach access as well. Um, let's take a look at some of the features that you get. So 300, 300 fiber internet to each resident. So I've had Google Fiber before, internet's fast. Also, you're going to get the GHO connectivity. So you're gonna have the Nest, the Wi-Fi enabled automatic uh, garage door, as well as the TV uh, mounted package. Moving on to the construction, you'll see that it'll be concrete block with reinforced steel. And you'll also have um, the impact windows. If you get a pool, it's uh, designed with LED. Um, also salt water. So if you take a look at my strand video, you'll have another solid understanding of what you could get with um, as far as the quality with GHO. Let's go on um, to the photo gallery and just kind of give you an idea of where everything's at. So as you can see, this is going to be the sea glass and then you have uh, 
um, the Indian River Lagoon over here as well as the beach right here. So Wabasso Beach is going to be located in this corner. As far as where you're located on the island, uh, Sea Glass is right here and then I've toured Oakid Cove which is another GHO community as well and this one is completely sold out. So um, this community is going to go fast. You have Beach Bites right here that's located in Wabasso. And if you didn't know, Vero Beach actually made number nine in top beach towns in Florida. So this is out of a list of 25 and it's covering the whole state of Florida. So I made a video covering five beaches. So not only do you have one of the beaches directly across the street, you have Golden Sands right up the road and then you have the Jungle Trail all along this area. So this is a, uh, a great trail if you uh, run, bike, walk, all that stuff. It's a great trail to go on. Just make sure it's not a hot summer day. You go across here, you have the Environmental Learning Center, you have the Wabasso Causeway Park, and if we scroll back out, you'll see Sebastian is located down here, and then you have Vero Beach located along here. So you can either take A1A or you could take US1, and it'll be around a five to 10 minute drive depending on traffic. So um, you're relatively close to both areas and um, it's in a great prime location. That's it for Sea Glass. We'll come back and check on this community once it's a little bit more developed and they have some models to show you that are actually inside the community. But at least you have a good idea of the quality that GHO provides. If you're looking to move to the Treasure Coast, please feel free to reach out. I'll let my information roll on the screen. But I'm Alex Ortega. I'm a real estate agent here. And if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out. I will see you guys in the next video.